ho ho, YouTubers! Welcome back to Galactic Gaming. This is Hatfield15 reporting for duty, and today we are back with some more Super Smash Bros. Ultimate! Welcome back to day three of Smash Week as well. So as you guys can see, yet again I've expanded my roster, and look who I actually managed to get from New Challengers. None other than Ridley. I wanted to save uh, me trying out like gameplay of him until this video today. So yeah, I'm right now in training so I can just try this guy out before I do a few rounds of regular Smash, try and get some new challengers, and eventually I will move on to some more World of Light, in which I actually managed to finally get past that one Isabel stage that was kind of ticking me off in the previous episode. So just before we begin, you guys, give this video please hit 15 likes, and if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, please be sure to smash the subscribe button if you want a shout out. Be sure to show your subscription to me publicly if you want to make sure you get a shout out. Also, make sure you ring and ding that notification bell so you never miss out on a single video during Smash Week. So, without further said, we're all systems go for this video in 3, 2, 1. Let's see if the way to play as Ridley was really worth it in the end. I mean, sure, I have the, the Ridley Amiibo, but I can't really control Ridley. Oh, well, isn't this just ironic? Uh, <laughs> oh my god, I was not intending this one bit. I mean, I... Set North here to Omega mode, but I wasn't expecting Samus. Okay, so let's see how far, how much can we jump? Okay, so we can jump three times. That's uh, not bad. Oh, okay, that was close. Let's check out our taunts, shall we? Classic. Ooh, oh, I like that. Ah, there's the taunt where he actually stands up. All right, let's actually compare his size to Samus. Actually, you know what? That actually looks pretty proportionate. So again, we no longer have to worry about really being too big essentially all right let's see what does our b button do ah okay so that's what it does we just press it once and it shoots off that little fireball but if we charge it then it'll do that kind of like for a charge beam that is actually pretty good ah okay so that does that all right let me move samus over a little ways so okay come on there we go now let's try Ooh. Yeah, I hate to do that to Samus after all this stuff. Like, Ridley clearly did that in other M, so that was actually pretty good. All right, let's check out um, what does our up B do? Okay, no, I said our up. Ooh, okay, not bad. Um, is, is it anything different uh, with the journey down? Okay, I wonder. I'm sure that'll do some damage. Oh, okay, so our down B. Oh, okay, so our down B is what lets us do the tail jab, which which. To quote Phil Swift, must do a lot of damage, so... Oh yeah, that's right. Alright, let's check out our A attacks, actually. Okay, that's not bad. Ooh. Definitely, like, most certainly not bad at all. Okay, it's giving me a little bit to get, like, a little... Come on. It won't let me... There we go. Took me a little bit to actually get that one. Now, I, have, I assume it's going to be a tail swipe if I... If I do it downwards, okay, it's giving me, uh, my Nintendo Switch controls are giving me a hard time to do it simultaneously. Oh, okay, that's, uh, not bad, not bad. All right, now let's see. Okay, so Samus is at 99% damage. I'm really sorry I gotta do this to you, fam. Ooh, now that is definitely a lot of damage, and we can easily just see how Samus clearly got freaking skewered right there. Now, I mean, of course, again, it's Samus, so of course she'll recover eventually, but... Okay, no, I'm not wanting to keep fireballing Samus. I just want to see if I can... Well, I'm sure I'll get a good Ridley Skewers shot. Okay. Nope. Okay, come on. Okay. It's not working for me as well as I anticipate, so maybe I got crush and then do that. Again, that's a lot of damage. That is definitely a lot of damage. And now, of course, unfortunately, we're going to have to mess Samus up a little bit more. And let's see, here we go, items, Final Smash, alright, let's check out our Final Smash personally. Ooh, I really do, got, I honestly do feel bad, oh my god, the ship is literally crashing, it's literally flying around in the background. <laughs> now that is actually pretty good. Again, regardless, I gotta say, the way to, um, to, to play as Ridley for all these months of anticipation was definitely worth it. I mean, his skills are not bad. I mean, my Nintendo Switch controls are being a little bit tricky with me because it's not letting me... Like, I try to hold these... I try to do them simultaneously like it would in other game modes in Smash 4, but, yeah, it doesn't really seem to want to do that in this go-round. All right, let's... Um, yeah, let's set our stock to about that. And, yeah, let's go with... 
All right, let's let's do something we actually haven't done yet. Um, okay, big battlefield. All right, let's try Final Destination. We haven't done Final Destination on Smash just yet. No, I want to go a little bit as a regular Ridley instead of Meta Ridley because the tail doesn't really look as sharp as it does with Meta Ridley because, look, yeah, you see, look at Meta Ridley's tail and then look at Ridley's tail. Ridley! Yeah, it doesn't exactly look as sharp. Now, again, my goal is just to get one skewer shot, in which that case, that will be the thumbnail for this video if it's good enough. Ooh. Music is definitely an improved. Uh, okay, nope. You want to go with... You want to go? Okay. All right, he's gonna, he's gonna be a bit of a jumpy boy, isn't he? Ah! Yeah, that's right, boy. That's what happens when you mess with the leader of the space pirates. Okay, come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Okay, Sonic's gonna be a little bit of a problem, but... Ah, look at that. Mother Brain is here. Oh, wait. Oh, okay, that's right. Majora inverted the controls, so... All right, you know what? It's Ridley and... Ah, uh, you suck. You suck, honestly. No. I hate Majora so much. I hate the Skull Kids so much. You know, that's exactly why I hate the, the Skull Kids so much. All right, now. Okay. Now, I gotta try and confuse Sonic. Or maybe I just gotta wait. Okay, nope, that didn't do... That didn't hit a sweet spot like it, like it would in order to, to do a lot of damage. It's gotta hit a sweet spot. Ah, there we go. We got him. Now... Nope. All right, let's let's go all Zawardo on him. All right, come on, let's try and all right, let's yeah, there we go, final smash work. Ooh, that is perfect. That is absolutely okay. I got. I'm sorry, I need to pause that and just take a look at that in my album. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, that is. Actually, you know what, I feel like I could do a little bit better, but if I don't get a screenshot better than that, that is definitely going in the thumbnail. That is without a doubt going inside the thumbnail for this video. So now let's just move into position and shoot Sonic into space onto Samus' gunship and blow it up. Again, I'm not going to lie, the graphics in this game are absolutely amazing, and of course this Ridley's really Final Smash goes to prove that. Okay, wait, what's going on in the background over there? Is that, I mean, whatever, like, I remember back from Smash 4, whenever we when we fought Master Core, like when Crazy Master Hand turned into Master Core, I find that Crazy Hand just kind of disappeared, and I don't know why Crazy Hand disappeared and, like, where, where exactly he went off to. Ah! Okay. Alright, again, I'm not exactly a big fan of grab attacks since they take up a little too much precious time. Okay, nope. Okay, ah, come on. I gotta be a little bit more on topic with the grab attacks. Alright, now let's grab a Maxim Tomato. Okay, oh, come on. Alright, yeah, Sonic may be fast, but he's definitely not strong enough to beat the likeness of the almighty Ridley. Come on. And now, okay, wait, I'm gonna... Oh, okay, so I don't actually blow myself up. Okay, come on. Ah, come on. Okay, I, w I will get a better screenshot than that at one point or another. Ah, come on. Okay, I wonder if I can... Yeah, I guess my one thing I'm trying to do is, like, confuse Sonic, like, stun... Like, hit Sonic so he'll be stunned so I can do a successful skewer. But again, that was a pretty good screenshot we got right there of really skewing Sonic. Ooh, I like that. I remember it saying that, like, Ridley and Dark Samus' victory themes were like a dark remix of the, um, item acquisition theme, almost like a game over theme. And, of course, uh, lovely old Daisy's now coming in. Yeah. Hey, Daisy. Sure, you may have gotten into Smash, in which the, fandom, the fans are going absolutely nuts about it, but, yeah, you still are not, you're never going to be strong enough to actually beat Ridley, because you have, do you know how strong Ridley actually is? Okay, now let's just, okay. I wonder if we can skewer... Okay, ah, crap, okay. I mean, this is actually the second Echo Fighter I've gotten aside from, uh... Who is it again? Okay. Okay, come on. I got... Okay, let's try and... Let's try and skewer Daisy. I want to try and skewer Daisy for the... Okay, oh, okay, crap. I gotta be a little bit more cautious, otherwise I'm not gonna make it. Now, okay, I need just... I need just the right timing with Daisy, otherwise... Okay, no. Okay, no. Now get a little... Okay, no, I have to hit a sweet spot still. Okay, no. Okay, maybe I gotta charge it a little bit. Ah, yes! Ah, crap, I missed it. I messed it up. Ow, and I accidentally taunted in the middle of that, which screwed me over even more. Okay, 
Now, come on. I gotta get one more good shot. Like, out. Okay, come on. Please. It's all... If you just cooperate with me for one... For a couple split seconds, Daisy, that would be all I ask. Ooh. All right. You know what? That works, too. That definitely works, too. Then again, I could also Photoshop that. And now we've got Daisy, who shouldn't be too far off from Peach, because obviously she's an Echo Fighter of that character. Now, okay, let's take a look a, a little bit more. Look. Uh, yeah, again, I would definitely like another skewer screenshot uh, that could definitely go in the thumbnail, but you know what? Let's head, out, let's head back to familiar territory and let's go to Frigate Orphean. Again, I just love this stage, not only because of just, you know, how well made it is, and it's just, in general, it's just a really good stage. Okay, you know what? Um, yeah, we're going to stay as Ridley for this one because I want it to look nice and brutal for the thumbnail. And we're going up against uh, Donkey Kong. I remember watching the video of uh, them translating all those like Smash Fighter names and then back to English. How I don't know how many times they translated it and from what languages, but I love how Donkey Kong's translation comes up as Don Conky, or however that's supposed to work. Yeah, there we go. This is my territory. It's my territory, Donkey Kong. Um, okay. Uh, okay, I wanted to, again, try and freeze them. Come on. All right. Yeah, let's get... Uh, I think... Yeah, I think this is Lynn from Fire Emblem because they mentioned her in the in the previous Nintendo Direct. At least I think it was the previous Direct. All right. And now the power has gone out thanks to Parasite Queen. And now I can do that. Hmm. And come on. Yeah. Wow, Lynn is doing a lot of damage. So you know what? I could get a, like a rivalry screenshot like Dragon versus... Uh, Dragon, like Lin versus Lin and Dragon form versus Ridley. That would be very cool. And now, okay, come on. Why is it so hard for me to get one freaking smash, dude? Oh, come on. Don't get, don't get the final smash. Good. And now, I wonder if I can hit the sweet spot. Okay. Okay, come on. Okay, get up, get up, get up, get up. Okay. Okay. Okay, crap. I don't know. Like, there should be a mechanic in this game that allows us to, like, escape grab attacks. Because those things are always, like, hella annoying in my eyes. Ah, come on. Okay, um, Donkey Kong, are you okay, man? Oh, okay, he kind of held on for too long. Come on, come on. Okay, I still have the final smash, thankfully. Ah, crap. Now I don't have the final smash because I waited too long. Alright, okay, and I will get the final smash back. Okay, I would do a Ridley impression, but I don't know how Ridley's voice would sound, because, again, I've never read the Magnus, and Ridley doesn't really talk in any of the Metroid games. Okay, come on, and... Oh, okay, I accidentally used the Final Smash, but you know what? That's okay, that's okay. I can definitely still get a good screenshot off of that if I have the opportunity to. Okay. Okay, come on. Come on, Donkey. Please cooperate with me a little longer. And now... Come on, okay. Uh, gravity's gonna get flipped now, so... Good. Okay, good. We can control where we go, essentially. So that would be even better. Alright, come on. Alright, you know what? Okay, yeah, up B doesn't seem... I mean, up B might do more damage than I anticipate, but... Ah, Alright, we didn't get any good uh, skewer screenshots, but you know what? On my own spare time, I might try and find a screenshot that'll work. Okay, same victory taunt as before, but again, I definitely love how in the trailers and generally in this game they show off Ridley's intelligent and sadistic nature because, yeah, Ridley isn't exactly a mindless beast, if you know what I'm saying. So, yeah, I really like how Nintendo incorporated his sadistic na and intelligent nature into the game, which, because, uh, you know, we have the side B and then the skewer attack. Alright, let's do one more attempt at a good screenshot of uh, me skewering someone, probably Ness in this case. And yeah, that'll be good. All right, definitely good Zelda themes going on. So yeah, it doesn't matter if you have uh, PK Thunder or Fire or whatever. Um, okay, wait. Okay. All right. Ah. Okay. Okay. Come here, boy. I'll show you who's boss around here. Again, this is definitely a very cool uh, move of Ridley's being able to just run his foes along the ground, kind of like he did with Samus and Other M when he dragged her across the wall. Ah. Okay, I mean, I would go to, like, a lower computer level, but that just kind of takes the fun and anticipation out of it. Okay, now we're going to dive out of the way. Okay, is he just going to keep spamming that, or am I actually going to be able to do some work? Yeah, he's just going to keep spamming uh, those two attacks, so... All right, oh, yeah, final smash. I can definitely get some good effects off of this. So, yes, and now... 
Yes, this is the opportunity I can wait for. Oh, ah, crap. Well, it was the opportunity I was waiting for. And then, of course, I didn't hit a sweet spot. Oh, okay. You know what? Again, Final Smash definitely still kind of works, too, even though... Uh, I just got. I just need to hit a sweet spot, but you know, what, I guess that might be a little hard to hit at some in some cases. And now, okay, uh, okay, we'll throw that out of the way. Okay, wait, is King Bublin coming? Yeah, I think King Bublin's on his way. If I, if my knowledge is correct, from playing this game all the time back in uh, Smash before. Oh, yep, there's King Bublin. And now there's the bomb. And now, oh yeah, there's that thing where it'll shoot stuff into the there. Ah, okay, yeah, Ness kind of conned me out into that one. Again, I definitely gotta say, I just really, in general, just love how Ridley works and just. Uh, okay, okay, no. Come on, gotta try and get him. Oh, okay, wait. he has the shooting, like the sword that shoots stuff. Ah, good. We can use uh, side beat to cover some distance. And now we've got whoever this guy is. I think he's from Street Fighter, but I, it hella looked like G.I. Joe. Oh, and, uh, yep, that's that done. Yep, we can get a nice Saiton in there. Mm. Oh, ah, oh, you thought, you thought. Uh, be gone. Come on. Okay, I don't, I don't know why Mr. Saturn's here. Like, does he do, doesn't really seem to do that much damage, in my opinion. And now, okay, that's a fake smash, so... Okay, come on. Okay. Oh, yes! Okay, I'm definitely saving that replay. Okay, I just kind of killed myself, but I'm going to save that replay so I can get that screenshot. And now, come on, we got to try and... Uh, let's try and get him like this! Ah, crap. Uh, I've never really, I've never really had that much faith when it comes to sudden death battles, but uh, you kind of win them all. And again, that is the perfect screenshot. That is... Uh, the, the, the screenshot I'm going to hopefully try and get from this replay is definitely going in the thumbnail for today's video, if that wasn't that good. Alright, now let's see. Do we have a new challenger coming? Doesn't really look like it. So, give me one more second to just go ahead and take a look at the look we got here. Um, okay, yeah, we could definitely still kind of get a, a bit of a better screenshot, but damn, I really love how, just how brutal and sadistic we, they made Ridley in this game. Alright, do we want to do, yeah, I think I've got all I need for like a good, uh, for a good thumbnail, so you know what, let's do Mute, Mute City SNES, because regular Mute City just isn't enough, and now, of course, we're going to do one more go as, uh, one more go before we head on to World of Light, and we're going to do it as my personal favorite variant, Meta Ridley, and again, I also like how they made a little Meta Ridley variant, variant for Mecha Ridley back in Zero Mission. That was definitely, most certainly a nice touch, if I do say so myself. And we're going up against Villager, because one Satan just isn't enough. Big Blue. Oh yeah, that's right, there is a Big Blue stage, uh, uh, a little, like, in, a, another little stage in this game. Okay. Ah, uh, okay, you know what, I, I should also try and get Meta Ridley doing a final smash, like shooting his laser breath, because, uh, yeah, Meta Ridley does have, uh, kinetic bomb breath, as it was called, in or, yeah, kinetic, uh, beam, uh, beam weapon. I'm not sure what exactly it was called, but he shoots lasers from his mouth as opposed to, like, regular fire, so that's definitely what I'm, definitely the context I'm going on about. I don't know, like, I don't know why, I mean, generally, uh, uh, Mr. Saturn is just kind of, like, one of those things where you just kind of throw him, uh, and not really do much with them. Yep. Hmm. Okay. Okay, I, I want to try and get him as he's charging up his fire breath, so you know what, that should be, okay, I know, I'm sorry, I know I'm just generally kind of obsessed with these Ridley screenshots, but again, I've waited pretty much six months for to play Ridley, so you know what, I'm not letting this opportunity go to waste. Okay, now, uh, let's see, what is it again? Okay, nope, uh, I don't want that. Nope, I don't want that, to quote, uh, whoever that guy was, I forgot what the game was called. Ooh, okay, super spooky. But, again, okay, wait, there was one more filter that actually really appealed to me. Which one was it again? Ah, it was, actually, you know what, I feel like I could get a bit of a better screenshot off that one. Okay, yeah, the, the little rolling crates are a little hard for me to, like, get. Okay, I like the down, the mid-air down A. It's kind of like Zero Sid Samus' down A, because it just, uh, generally, it kind of lets you just, uh, it just lets you meteor smash your opponents, in which case that could lead to an accidental suicide if I'm, if I'm uh, stupid and unlucky enough. Hmm. Oh, okay. Wait. Okay. No. Nope. I want. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. All uppies must do. Well. I mean, aside from the inklings. I mean, not all uppies do damage. So. Yeah. I mean, of course, I'm a guy who just generally kind of favors upbeat attacks. That might be my problem. Ah. 
Yes, this is exactly what I'm hoping for. Boy! Ah, and I can just tell from the little caption up there that that was perfect. And, of course, I mean, I'm sure, I hope Samus has insurance because, yeah, her ship just completely got uh, destroyed. And now, okay, down A. Don't let Satan get the Death Scythe. And now, okay, we wait for him. We wait. Ooh! Okay, that is def- I almost- that is most- this replay is most certainly a keeper because- Ah, uh, yeah. Again, I'm, I'm just gonna have so many good plays by the end of this. I'm hoping to make a, like a good highlights reel of Smash Week by uh, next Friday when Smash Week generally comes to an end. Which might I add, I should actually kind of start work on that because I haven't done so just yet. And now we're gonna send the chickens on Villager. Okay, okay. Oh, okay, wait. Oh, I thought they were going for me, but... Nah, no, they aren't going for me. Oh, okay, it's Villager. Oh, I also, again, I also like how they have, like, a little map of the stage, like, how far out you really are. Ah, okay, not exactly the result I'm hoping for. All right, look, come on, let's try and get one more skewer in there. Or not. Again, we definitely won that match, and I'm definitely satisfied with the wait for having to play as Ridley. All right, I mean, if we could get some more, if we can get a different victory taunt next time, that would most certainly be nice, but... Again, Ridley has finally hit the big time. Oh, okay. Um, I think that's Roy. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's I. I've, ne I've never played as Roy before. Yep, this is Roy. I've never. I didn't buy Roy back in Smash Four when he was a DLC character. So, okay. Can we uh, wait a minute. If we can get a skewer screenshot uh, of uh, of me impaling, if we can get a shot of impaling Roy, that would e that would be even better. Now, okay, come on, just come a little closer, boy. I said a little closer. Ah, oh, oh, crap, I messed it up. I can't save the replay of that. Damn it. Damnations. And of course, I'm, the worst thing is I can't, I can't, I, I can't, like, save the replay of it, and I can't really screen record it, so that just makes my case even worse here. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay, careful. Oh, okay. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, crap, he got me. But then again, this isn't the first... A uh, new challenger that's kind of done me like that. Okay. Oh, no. I accidentally selected that. So, uh, I guess I'm so used to pressing the A button. So, yeah. Again, I've definitely got... I mean, regardless if I, if I could have gotten a better screenshot of really skewering someone, I thought that's a screenshot of me skewering uh, Ness would definitely do. But anyways, it's now time to head on back to World of Light where I finally got past that one stage that was kind of frustrating me in the previous episode. Now, I figured out... How, like, I've asked my friends on the Discord server on Genesis that how to get past, like, the one part where I need to pilot a boat and how to make the mushrooms grow a little bigger. Okay, um, R, tilt. Okay, wait a minute. Oh, okay, I guess those areas I can't go to yet. But anyways, again, uh, those areas um, that are kind of blocked off, like, I need to grow mushrooms and all that stuff. I guess I need to collect uh, people with spirits uh, or just collect spirits in general and then they would do... The dirty work for us so yeah all right dr strangelove uh bayonetta um yeah i never played as bayonetta before so i definitely don't feel i have an advantage okay let's see what i ah good okay so attacks do have an advantage over grabs so yeah okay um okay yeah the red lens flare that just get, definitely gives bayonetta a little bit of uh style to her look again i'm just saying that okay midgar okay okay all right should have read the conditions in which case i Forgotten yet again. Ah. Whew. Okay, is Bayonetta even doing anything? Because I am just racking up all the hits on her. Like, it's... Okay, I should have read the condi... Ooh. Ooh. I didn't know Bayonetta could do that. But again, this is what happens when I... When I didn't download Bayonetta back in the previous game. And thus, I've never really played as her. So, yeah. And then again, we now have Strangelove. Rage Blaster equipped. I know that Rage Blaster is gonna definitely get stronger the more damage you take. But... Nah, I'm just gonna pass on it. Okay, I shouldn't I shouldn't dismiss any spirits just in case it becomes necessary. Or maybe it's fighters, I have no idea. Oh, okay, now we've got okay, now it's a different role, and now we've once again got Isabel. So now we need to trade out um Rain. Okay, maybe we should try and level up Rain a little bit, because I tried doing that and it helped me out quite a bit. So let's just go ahead and level up our boy Rain a little bit. Or Rain, I have no idea how it's pronounced. Okay, um, I think I'm supposed to use that? I don't know for sure. Now let's just give him a couple snacks, why don't we? Ah, there we go. Rain is max level. Now, I'm not sure, like, I mean, some spirits are supposed to, like, evolve into, like, 
um, new forms, whatever, but I have no idea what determines that or what spirits essentially do that. But regardless, Rain is now uh, top level and we are ready for round two against Isabel. Hopefully this one's going to be a less of a pain in the arse. Take your strongest team into this no frills battle. Um, oh, wait a minute. There's Diddy Kong here. So, yeah, okay, that's definitely... I never knew there was... Uh, more than one roll because I'm normally used to the one from Mega Man. Oh my god, uh, Diddy Kong is so... Diddy Kong is a tiny boy. Oh, okay, now... Ah, come on. Okay, I gotta try and... I gotta try and outplay Isabella, essentially. I mean, I mean, it's a little... It's def that last stage was definitely a little tricky because... Um, yeah, there was all that... Uh, because we... There was two people against one. Oh god, oh god. Okay, so it's all... Uh, the only items falling are the... Uh, are the rockets from Pikmin. So this is going to be a bit of a pain in the arse if I'm not careful and watching where I'm going. Boom! Oh, what? How did that not hit? How could that have possibly not hit? Oh, ah, good. Okay, I wish there was... No! Ooh, okay, I wish there was, like, some kind of... I, again, like a meteor, like a like a, a, a down A like Sam, like a meteor down A like Samus's that would let me just knock him out of the park. Okay, now good. Isabella is right where I want her. She is right where I want her. And uh, okay, no, boom. Ah, finally, I got that on the first go. That took me so long to beat Isabel in the previous one. Slightly increases the power of projectile weapons such as bows or guns. Okay, so I definitely want to gonna want to keep roll around for later on in life. So again, there's like that one glowy thingy a little ways into that, uh, into this little base or whatever, but I don't know, um, okay, yeah, there's, yeah, that thing, that thing right there, okay, and there's a new fighter right over there, so I'm not sure what exactly I have to do. Okay, now there's Andy and then Dr. Mario, so let's see who's over here. Um, we've got Ricky against Little Mac, uh, or Ricky paired up with Little Mac, so, you know what, let's see, okay, there seems to be a gate, so maybe we have to unlock it or destroy it, I... Don't know. Okay, now we've got Dr. Mario here, so we're going to want to change our spirit yet again to Charlotte Allen. Um, okay, wait a minute. Okay, yeah, Charlotte, well, I mean, Charlotte's a higher level, but, but she's still by default a lot stronger. Okay, no, I'm, I'm probably going to want to put in a support spirit like a uh, Yakuman player. It slightly increases attack power. Yes, there we go. That is without a doubt my ideal boss, uh, my ideal spirit team, because we got someone who's uh, who's uh, strong against uh, his spirits, and then we've got two support spirits that will increase our stuff. Oh, great. Now we've got eight snakes along alongside him, too, and that's going to be even worse, because I have never played a snake before, and I've never played Brawl, so... Okay, there's a fake final smash. Ooh, the halberd. Okay, the halberd's locking onto other people, so let him do their thing. Ah, okay, good. I think they... Hit. Oh, no! Ooh, now that was close. Wait, did I win? Okay, not yet. I haven't won just yet, so let's blow it up. Ah, yes. Okay, now there's the fight, fight final smash again. Okay. Oh, okay, wait. Um, okay, did he... I just saw... What? What? Okay, I don't even, I don't, I'm not even keeping track of where I'm going anymore. Okay, oh, oh wait, am I supposed to just keep doing this? Yeah, okay, it's just like a couple modes in uh, Classic Mode or whatever back in Smash 4. You're supposed to, this is what you're supposed to do. Now let's blow it up. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about right there. That was how we do it. All right, now we've got a good primary spirit, uh, Andy, who's uh, good with grab attack, so I should definitely... Keep him in mind as well, even though Rain is uh, definitely our good, our best spirit when it comes to countering uh, shield enemies or sh people who are strong with shields. Um, okay, wait, there's this. It looks like the lock on the gate can be opened somehow. Um, okay, yep, looks like we're moving on. Maybe there's this pipe, yeah, there's a war pipe right here, so maybe this will take us somewhere important. I mean, at least I'm hoping it'll take me somewhere important so I can unlock that gate and just various other things because I don't want to have to figure out how to do all this stuff and get all this all these spoilers and all that okay wait forgot to read up on the conditions yet again hey little Mac don't you, do you remember me I was already a referee yet during the older days uh, again even in Super Smash Ultimate I'm definitely still doing all these uh, cringy ass Mario impressions and, of course, again, like uh, being the typical player I am, I am just constantly spamming uh, up A, or up B, I should say. Not up A. Up A does that, but still, upwards attacks are just kind of generally my kind of main goals and direction. But then again, every Smash player has their own different uh, attack strategies that work for them. 
And so just spamming up A definitely just essentially seems to work for me. Now let's just bring Mac down here. Okay, no. Oh, ow. Okay, crap. Ooh, okay. There, okay, that actually didn't do that much damage, which actually, for the record, actually honestly surprises me. Up. Oh, there we go. We're gonna blast them. Blast them. Ah, yes. And now. Okay, wait, we, we've gotta try and we gotta try and do a charge A. Like we gotta try and do a tilt A as we as he's coming back. So that's the only way we're gonna get him out this time. Oh, or he'll just uh, mess up his up A uh, or up B back here. And we've got support one. It slightly increases the power of uh, punches and elbow strikes. Okay, that's definitely gonna still come in handy when we get to that point. Again, I have no idea or, or enough time to read all that Bayonetta stuff before it loads up. Alright, let's see. Um, <sighs> there are so many block paths for me. I mean, is there some kind of key I'm missing? Or what am I... Essentially, what am I missing here? Um, DQ Link against Diddy Kong, and then there's... Uh, Okay, we all right, let's just go up against uh, Squirtle once again because I've done it before. And now, yes, there we go. We now have the edge on Squirtle or Pokemon Trainer. I, I, I wonder where, I mean, I, I saw like the Pokemon. Okay, we're going up against four Squirtles, hopefully not in unison. Neutral specials. Okay, so maybe they're going to be holding still. Okay, I have no idea. Like, I don't know where. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, no, okay, no, ah, crap, I got caught in the, I got caught in the stream, and that would be, that was very bad, because I couldn't get up fast enough, um, okay, yeah, the healing sprout, okay, so as long as I'm holding that thing, it will slowly heal me, but, yeah, okay, I'm just learning more and more of how these items are supposed to work, so neutral specials, so that's when they're holding still, still, aren't they, so, I just gotta be aware of that, because, I mean, it's kind of strange, because the Pokemon trainer, because, uh, Pokemon trainer, um, is kind of, and kind of, uh, controls Squirtle, Ivysaur, and Charizard, so, you know, that's a little, uh, that's a little different, and it's kind of odd not seeing him in the background, and there we go, um, up that way, and, uh, boom, okay, nope, boom, okay, wait, neutral specials, again, I have no idea, I don't know all these, every single one of these technical terms, so, uh, I've gotta try and study these technical terms a little more, like, neutral, tilt, all that stuff, so, remind me to do that, uh, after this episode, Ah, good, that's one, actually that's, oh, okay, that's, uh, that's three down and one to go, so, let's try and get our game straight, and now, boom, yep, we just, Super Mario, um, we super punch him into the sky, yep, that's how we do it, that is definitely how we do it, uh, slightly increases the power of water and ice attacks, okay, alright, again, that's definitely gonna come in handy when I get Pokemon Trainer or Squirtle or, whoever the hell back so yeah that will definitely come in handy Whew. all right good that's another one down maybe I'm maybe I'm supposed to okay I'm not supposed to come around and do it like that so uh, come on like seriously am I supposed to summon a spirit or something or am I supposed to free a fighter again I have no idea <sighs> looks like the lock uh, on this gate can somehow uh, can be opened somehow um, am I supposed to just attack or what am I supposed to do because this is just honestly getting annoying now and um, okay summon okay how can I am I able to summon a spirit um that's right I could summon uh I mean I, w I might be able to summon Ashley a little later I'm, j I'm just missing the star rods core so I need to find star rod and therefore I think I can uh make those mushrooms bigger okay maybe it's something to do with the fighter maybe maybe it's all that maybe it's in terms of the fighter let's see who could open a gate who could be capable of opening a gate? Um, let's try Pac-Man. I actually haven't played Pac-Man in a while, so hopefully maybe he can somehow um, break the lock somehow. Uh, okay. All right. Looks like we're looks like we're kind of doing it like this for now. Okay. Am I? There's seriously nothing I can do here. All right. This is really getting hell annoying. So you know what? Let's just fight DQ Link. Okay. I'm not that good with Pac-Man, so I should kind of be aware of that. And now we've got uh, attack right over him. Okay, I get, again, I definitely noticed. Uh, I now know the essential pattern here. Neutral specials, certain items uh, will appear in large numbers over time, and just so on and so forth. Oh, okay, okay, wait. Okay, oh, I forgot how I'm not good with Pac Man. Okay, up, oh, good. Uh, okay, okay, good. We can bring it. Let's bring him down here. Okay, he doesn't really look evil nowadays. He just looks like he hasn't gotten 
any sleep whatsoever. Like, uh, essentially, like, he, lo he, do he just looks, uh, he just looks like he hasn't gotten sleep in years. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Okay, wait, this is my chance. And boom! Yes, I just gotta wait. I just gotta confuse them. Yes, I gotta use these Dekus. Ha! Got him. Or I almost got him. And, and that didn't exactly work out. Okay, crap. Final smash meter is almost full. Ah, crap. Item title wave. I forget. Okay, is there a way to snap out of confusion a little faster? Because there must be... There must be some way. Oh! Okay, I used these Dekus to beat them. Alright, good. Deku Link, uh, Primary Spirit. I, I don't know if it's primary spirits uh, to actually do that stuff. Okay, I'm definitely gonna suffer if I can't... Yeah, I'm definitely... I'm most certainly gonna suffer if I can't figure out how to open the lock and all that stuff because I have no idea generally where I'm going. Okay, wait a minute. What's this? Um, okay, we've got uh, Calypso over there. Uh, oh, we, we can fight Incineroar. Well, yeah, there's a new fighter up ahead, so you know what? It's worth fighting Incineroar because... Man, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, Incineroar definitely looks a little overpowered in my opinion. Okay, Lava Floor. Okay, I gotta be aware of that, so let's just get that spirit ready. Okay, Fiery Floors. Um, okay, there must be some... There's someone who makes me immune to something. Increases the power of projectiles, um, holding items, uh, Rage Blaster, Lipstick, um, crap. I don't have a... I don't have a fiery hand. Okay, immunity to poison, immunity to sticky floors, uh, immunity to changes in gravity. Ah, crap. All right, you know what? Um, I'm just gonna avoid the floor, essentially. So you know what? Hopefully I shouldn't screw this up. Okay, how many incineroars am I fighting? Three, four, four? Oh, okay. Oh, they're all tiny incineroars. Okay, that's not bad. Good. Oh, and they only have 10 HP. Oh, okay, so, okay, wait, ow, nope. Uh, good. Okay. Okay, there's only... I'm only really fighting, um, all, only, like, tiny Incineroars, and they're all super tiny, so they can only be knocked out with one hit. So, you know what? This is actually pretty easy. Yeah, this is definitely one of the easier things I can actually think of accomplishing. Oh, yeah, I forgot that side special or whatever it is. I don't know, but whatever it is, it's definitely overpowered, and I think it should be nerfed in an upcoming update. Up. Uh, good. Now, I don't know how many more Incineroars are coming my way. Okay. Oh. No, okay. I'm doing pretty good with uh, avoiding the floor. I mean, it's taking a little while, but... Okay. All right. You know what? Let's just... Let's just get rid of their HP with uh, the Fire Flower, because nothing's wrong with using items to do your dirty work in, uh, sometimes. Okay. Good. And now that's just one to go. Ah! We totally crushed them onto our feet, essentially. Oh, okay, I thought uh, someone's final smash meter must have done. Ah, okay, so the red pigment is what makes us immune to lava floors. Okay, that was definitely worth uh, doing it without the fighter four, but... Or without a spirit w beforehand, but regardless, I mean, we have that now. All right, now we're moving on. Okay, wait, what's this? Oh, master hand. Um, okay, wait. Oh, okay, you destroyed the bridge, so it doesn't look like we're getting to that spirit in particular. Ah, Donkey Kong, okay. So let's go ahead and get Donkey Kong back. Oh, okay, no way, I already have the advantage over him, so you know what? Um, oh, wait a minute. Oh, never mind, I thought I had the advantage, but I have the disadvantage. So let's switch it back to attack, in which I have the advantage, and there we go. We should be able to be able to counter Donkey Kong successfully. Again, hopefully, maybe he can break the gate down. I mean, he must be able to break it down. Um, Donkey! Okay, you gotta listen. You gotta snap out of it, man. Galeem's controlling you. And he's generally controlling everybody else, but snap out of it, man. Like, for God's sake. I mean, I don't know why. Like, I guess for some, like, for Mario and some other characters, it was, like, uh, Final Destination. But, yeah, for, for here, like, uh, but, uh, for other characters, it's, like, stages that correspond to their, uh, game and their franchise. Well, like, just like the fighters in, uh, in, like, when we, uh, accomplish new, uh, when you, we, blah, 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 blah. sorry, language, um, a message it up. There we go. Alright, good. We have a... Boom! Yeah, there we go. Once we have a flame bar sword in hand, we automatically have the advantage. And now we have Donkey Kong on our side, so... Okay, yeah, we got a lot of skill spheres, so we must be able to level something up sometime in the future. Hopefully, not too much uh, longer from now. Again, uh, you know what? I'm definitely gonna find out how to get past that one part right here. Let's see. Um, Slash Man, and then there's Mega Man. Alright, let's see. What's the story with this bridge over here? The bridge is out. Maybe there's a way to fix it. Um, okay, wait. Menu. Okay, good. We can use the... We can actually go to the skill tree. Now, let's see. What do we want to do here? 
Slightly increases defense when damage is less than 30%. Okay, that's good. And then makes stopping easier when walking or running. Um, increases the... Okay, no, I don't have enough for that. And um, endless hold, smash hold and grass ability to hold smash attacks indefinitely. Alright, uh, that might not be a good thing. I don't have enough for that, nor that. So you know what? Let's just go ahead and do that one. We'll, we'll just increase those neutral attacks or whatever is going on here. Alright, five minutes left for the video. Crap, I am definitely gonna have to uh, try and question question around and ask, like, what the hell am I actually supposed to be doing here? Um, okay, we got Choo Choo, so that's, I got, I think that's a Kirby enemy or something. Ah, Poppy Bros Jr. Okay, wait a minute. Oh, good, I, I automatically have the advantage, so you know what? Alright, let's actually switch it back to Mario, because I don't feel that good with Pac-Man. So you know what, let's combat a Sword Fighter with a Sword Fighter. So you know what, I'm automatically gonna say... Exactly. The announcer said it just as I said it. So maybe that chest has something inside it we can use to uh, either fix the bridge or uh, open the gate or something because it is definitely getting a little annoying uh, now. Alright, and then again, wait a minute, Poppy Bros Jr. Okay, the enemy favors uh, down air specials or something like that. Okay, wait. Ah! Uh, boom! Alright, Young Link. All, I mean, I, I, I've commented, I think I've commented on this in, pre, in the previous video, but I don't, exact, I don't exactly like to play as uh, any of the links in general, mainly because of the fact that, um, primarily because of the fact that generally all links are the same because we have three links, essentially. We have regular link or champion link, then we have two link, and now young link is back. And that just doesn't really seem that good to me. Okay, that's another primary spirit, so that's... Pretty good, pretty good, and now let's see what's inside this chest. Hopefully it's not bonus items or whatever, and maybe it's something that can actually help us along in our confusing uh, journey right here. Let's see, what is it? Wrinkly Kong, okay, starts battle off with 30, um, okay, 30% uh, higher damage than defense. Okay, that's, okay, uh, okay, you know what, let's just, okay, nope, um, they have the advantage over me, so I need, okay, Sticky Floor, um, I gotta, I gotta use my spirit that's immune to Sticky Floors, and which one, was it again? Which one was it? Immune to sticky floors. Immune to sticky floors. Which one was it? Uh, uh, okay, reduces damage taken. Okay, draws nearby enemies. I am closer. Okay, wait, maybe it was a prime. I think it was a primary spirit. So, uh, yeah, it's probably a primary spirit that makes me immune to sticky floors. Oh no, wait a minute. Never mind. That's completely. That's completely not the story I'm talking about right here. Um, immune. St um, Sticky floors. Okay, you don't have enough slots to add this support um, item. All right, um, let's just remove him, and now we should have. Okay, wait a minute. Is he? Don't have enough slots to add this uh, to add this support to the team. Um, okay. Well, crap. Um, whew, Okay. Well, crap. Oh, I'm, I'm just gonna have to think. Okay, let's just increase attack power. Okay, again, it should be. I should do the same thing I did with Incineroar. Just generally, just avoid the. Uh, avoid the sticky floor, and I should be okay. And Jigglypuff is moving rather slow. Uh, Booski, okay, up and over, and now, boom, up and boom, okay, ah, and boom, ah, okay. Oh, here comes that grab attack. Now we're gonna come on over here. Okay, Wispy Woods is doing its thing, so up over, okay, ah, yes, okay, good. That's exactly what I am hoping for now. Ha! Ah, yes, okay, now that banana is coming right down to where we need it. Okay, I, I couldn't get the timing right it right just when I needed it, essentially. Ah, good, okay. Oh, nope, the sticky floor ain't gonna impede me today. Yep, nothing will stop me. Whoa, no! No! No, that was close. Ah, good, and now we're dual-wielding Marth, so we automatically win! Again, that is always so satisfying when we just hit that Super Slash. Starts the battle with Super Leaf. That's not going to be really that appealing in my opinion. Alright, con uh, continue with dodging penalty. If you dodge too often, something, something, so forth. I, I didn't have time to read that. I mean, if they give us a little more time, that would be nice. Um, okay, do we want it to do Rayman? Um, let's see. The enemy's physical attacks have increased power. Stamina battle. Hostile assist trophies will appear. Um, okay, so in this case, I'm going to want to... Swap out my spirit to increase attack, so Charlotte, you're my main game, and uh, let's see, yep, Charlotte, uh, Yakuman player, and Sandbag are my main players for this one, so let's try and make this the last battle for today. Again, I'm definitely going to have to try and figure out what exactly I'm supposed to do. Maybe I'll just, maybe once I figure that stuff out, I'll just go ahead and, uh, maybe I'll go ahead and figure out 
I'll just go ahead and figure that out. Uh, I'll, I'll basically just figure out how to unlock that stuff and unlock it so I'm not wasting any time for uh, the next video. Okay. Oh, all right. Again, we just got to have a little bit of patience and just actually dodging the assist. Uh, we just got to try and dodge the assist trophy. Oh, oh, nope. Ah, okay, good. Oh, okay, nope. Oh, wait, oh, I forgot it's a stamina battle. I completely forgot it's a stamina battle. Ah, okay, ah. Okay, okay. Is this assist trophy going to stick around forever, or am I just doing it right? Am I doing... Ah, uh, ah, okay. Okay, um, no. Okay, okay, good. Good. Uh oh, 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 okay, finally, the assist trophy is done for, so now we can set that up. Ah ha ha! He walked, he literally just walked right into that. And now that the assist trophy is taken care of, uh, my work should be a little bit easier. And by that, it should be because I'm already low stamina. Ah! Okay, oh, come on. Get it right. Good. Okay, we're kind of getting it right. Ah! Ah! Come on. We gotta try and. Okay. Crap! Okay. Uh, crap. As long as he has that blaster, I am essentially screwed. Ah! Okay. Okay, wait. Ah! Good. Uh oh. Final smash. He's gonna go Super Saiyan. Oh, okay. Nope. Ah! Crap. I couldn't use my final smash fast enough. Damn it. All right, I'm gonna end up, I'm gonna go ahead and end off the video here, you guys. So again, definitely satisfying waiting for Ridley to finally play as him. I'm gonna go ahead and try and unlock that base and all that stuff, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. So for now, that's about all the time we've got today. So thank you all for joining me today. Be sure to subscribe, leave comments down below because I like them, and crank that like button to Max like Soldier Boy. Till then, I'm Hatfield15. Space out, Rosa Rositas.